I mean, there's nothing in the world that excites me uh, and stimulates me more than going on a trip, really, whether it's in Italy or, or Oxfordshire or, 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 or China. The intensity of the, of the work and the complete focus on the landscape. I'm not, I don't know whether it's a, a spiritual thing particularly, but there's a kind of uh, a heightened intensity that accompanies the process that's completely thrilling and at the same time completely exhausting. Huangshan, the Yellow Mountain, uh, was a sort of key destination for me. And I'm almost embarrassed to say this, but European mountains are going to seem rather kind of paltry after the Yellow Mountain. It's the most shocking and extraordinary and dramatic piece of landscape. The Chinese love mountains. Um, they have uh, a kind of spiritual relationship with them and also um, a kind of deep affection for them. And so there are quite a few visitors, but they have a lovely attitude and the, and the mountains themselves are peppered with temples, which, which gives the landscape scale as well as the people um, but also constantly reminds you that the mountains are more than just mountains they're actually um, uh, places of places of worship I suppose apart from anything else I've been working from a great height for a lot of the time and when I was in Hong Kong I was uh, quite often 15 floors up looking down onto the landscape as though I was a map maker and uh, the same thing was true on these amazing mountains in Wuishan and Huangshan and and then later on in Yangshou and Guilin. Um, so the, the, the physical resemblances between the curving roads zooming in and out of Hong Kong and the curving rivers snaking around the mountains in the places I was painting in the countryside in mainland China, and of course the skyscrapers and the mountains, uh, formed a, a very obvious sort of pair of parallel worlds. But the paintings now have been have been turned into pictures that are as much about me as they are about China. The thoughts I'm having about, about, about the painting and about the painting in relation to the place. People say, kind of, what time of day was that? Or what? I mean, they're, they're, they're no longer times of day in every case. They're sort of, they're, they're, they're a collage of ideas that I've had about the place and, and a, a seed that was planted while I was there. <laughs> I don't know how pleased I am because I think it's the, uh, I mean, uh, uh, the, the work's been, the whole process has been an, in, an adventure. I could have gone down a thousand different paths and I'd like this to be the beginning of something rather than the end. How could it be comprehensive? It's a tiny scratch on the surface of a vast and, and extraordinary subject. Um, I hope I have a chance to, to, to carry on.